Hey guys, for this, let's you know that this new jailbreaking program called Acid Snow have. Oh my god, what was that? Oh, something. I'm not sure what that was, but that was something in the background over here. What the hell was that? I'm not sure. Uh, but a new beta of Acid Snow have been released, beta 2. Uh, and I've been seeing some comments that Acid Snow, they were, you know, just copying up Red Snow or something like that. And that could be the case why they're making this beta 2 right now and, you know, change off their coding and stuff like that. But uh, it is not compatible with iOS 5.0.1 and iOS 5.0 uh, only Mac, you know, still uh, OS X Lion and Snow Leopard. Uh, the products that's well before and were iOS devices iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, iPad 1, and iPad Touch 4th generation. Not iPad Touch 3G, not iPad Touch 2G, not iPad 2, not iPhone 4S. So, you know, be sure that you know about that. Be sure also that know that this is a tethered jailbreak, not a untethered jailbreak. But, you know, I've been running an, a tethered jailbreak on my, 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 my Avatar 4G uh, for some time now. And I don't think it's that bad. Usually I have my iPod Touch turned on like 24 7. So it's not actually a big deal for me. Uh, this tethered is, I mean, it's almost like a untethered. Uh, but as there's no beta 2 available right now, Redmond Pi have the instructions on how you can go ahead and install it and getting up, getting it up and, you know, fire up City and do all of those things. But I really don't see why you should use Acid Snow when you have like Red Snow out there and uh, Snow Breeze. Uh, but I would recommend Red Snow. Snow Breeze may be better for Mac. I'm not sure. Don't think so though. Uh, Acid Snow, yes. Where about right now? Download links in the description. See.